this may sound backwards, but sometimes I think it's best that we go back in order to move forward. And a lot of times in my life, and I think we all do, try to move on from things without actually processing them. We try to act like it never happened and just move forward with a smile on our face. And I've done this before. And even though I was going through stuff, I just kind of acted like it just didn't bother me that much when it when I did and I even convinced myself I think it didn't bother me that much and I recently just had to take some time away from posting on socials and I just was alone with God and I wrote songs and journaled all these feelings that I had from this relationship I was in and I gave myself time to feel my feelings which I think I try and bottle up sometimes but when we bottle up them eventually will explode because these patterns we place on other people. We don't give ourselves time to move forward. But I think it's important that we confront these dark places in order to move on. So of course, it's not the easiest thing, and the only thing that helps me through it is God, because I know for sure I could not do it on my own. I'd be filled with so many dark thoughts, and it would bring me through so much pain that I honestly just wouldn't even want to think about it anymore. I would want to think about something else. But when... I go through it with Jesus, and when I process these things slowly, eventually, I start feeling the peace, and I start coming at ease with my, with what happened in the relationship, and um, I guess I'm saying all this to say it's easy to run away from your problems, but it takes uh, some true character to stand up to them and say, you're not going to take me down this time and just walk through it. It might be painful and ugly, and you might cry a lot of tears, but there's beauty in the sadness. Sometimes sorrow is better than laughter. Going back to move forward.